Okay, here we are again with Overlord Season 4 Episode 3 and yeah, if you hear something in the background, some noise, that's my fan. If you hear something, um, because today is like a super warm day and I need my fan. And um, But yeah, Overlord Season 4 Episode 3, um, last episode was super hype because we basically found out that, or it sounded like that Albedo and maybe Eins even, maybe that's Eins' plan, but I think this plan comes from Albedo, maybe Demiurge. Um, they plan to in, in they plan an invasion on Reestes, and Albedo, I think, laid the groundwork last episode for that to happen. And we also found out at the very end that Rena is working together with Albedo, and probably Eins, but I think. Eins maybe doesn't know about it, I don't know. I don't know who knows what right now, but we saw Renner with Albedo, uh, Albedo, and so, yeah, that's very interesting and got me really hyped up for the rest of the season. And I would say let's get into episode four, uh, three. <laughs> um, but yeah, if you like what you see and if you want to support me, leave a like, subscribe or a comment, I would really appreciate it and it would be really helpful for me. And yeah, let's get to the episode. <laughs> Okay, so now she goes, so, so this is from before, last episode? Oh, oh, it's a world item, I guess. She's happy. He cares for me. Extra careful. We don't know what to expect. Oh. <laughs> of course. Of course. Dude, Eins. Okay. I don't know if that's true. But sure, if she thinks it helps, dude, Eins, go. He's not doing it. <laughs> oh my god! She's exploding. That's enough for her. She's so happy. Oh my god, this is so sweet. Oh my god! Yes! Oh, I love it so much. <laughs> Forget everything. Delete it. Oh, the slain theocracy. What are they planning? Yeah, we don't know much about these guys. Of course, they talk about him. Indeed, they did. <laughs> <laughs> I want them. <laughs> yep, intervene. I want to see it. Exactly. Okay, let's see it. Let's see it. I want the information. Let me guess, we won't find out. Oh, I mean, death knights are very powerful, we learned that. So having 500 of them is crazy. None. <laughs> you can surrender. The black scriptures, isn't that the super strong people thingies? They are still humans, but they are godkin, I guess. They're like, uh, yeah, those. I want to see the left one. I want to see her. I forgot her name. It was too much depression. <laughs> Who's this? Oh. Yeah. Exactly. <laughs> oh, wait, what? Wait, wait, let me, let me check again. We gave him support and a large and safe region for their development. So that's the Reestis kingdom, right? All in hopes that they would cultivate heroes to fight against and invade other non-humans. So they basically want 
wanted them to get strong people and then fight against non-humans. Okay, so lizard men and all that stuff. Oh, so rotting from within. Oh, that's the eight finger. Uh, eight fingers, I think. Exactly, the <laughs> fake demiurge. Because they are all together. Uh, maybe they figured out. Uh? Huh? Oh. oh yeah, that's what happens. <laughs> Fool! I think that's not working with him. You need powerful holy magic against him. Oh, he loses hair from stress! <laughs> Merchants? What do they have? It must be something very valuable. Oh, that's the merchant? He has no more confidence, he's done. <laughs> Dude, he is so different from when we met him. He is completely done. Somewhat, yeah, I guess. He saw it firsthand. He was right next to him. Just obey him, dude. It's it's fine. You will have a good life. Just don't go against them. Oh, these guys. There's a monkey guy. Oh, new adamant, uh, adamantite adventurer. I think they will die. <clears throat> they don't have enough... I feel like they don't have enough main character vibes. I, I bet there is still something. Because Irons and his people can use crazy stuff. They can probably counter the counters. We, we heard it. Fluda was like the only one that was like a shield to them. Because he was so pow powerful. He's full. An arena. They live in ignorance. They don't know better. The priest has arrived. Let's see. Who is it? Do we know him? Oh, it's... Those? Is, isn't, isn't that the guys from the slaying theocracy we saw earlier? Do we see some action? I mean, we saw Colosseum scenes in the trailer. And we saw Eins. Do we see Eins, maybe? That would be crazy. Oh, oh. Oh, oh. Is it Ainz? <laughs> so, the War King is a troll that is like super strong. If it's Ainz, he, if it's Ainz, he loses, man. Oh, is it Ainz? Is it? Oh my god, it is! <laughs> oh, they get a first glance of his power, dude. They can see it up front. He shits his pants right now. Oh, they are suspicious of him. Dude, he's shitting his pants right now. He needs help. Oh, here he is! <laughs> oh! Oh! 
まさかこのようなところで顔を合わせるとは本当に偶然とは恐ろしい<笑><笑><笑> Yes indeed すべては奴の作望だったのだ本来であれば名乗るのが当然ですが下級の要件で速やかに退席しなければならなかったと Of course it does 私どものことは Run while you can If you can, if you can. <笑>そうかそれはまことに残念 It would be a shame if you leave right now when we have our fight here next. Oh, it's so good. Yeah, but you can. I would be surprised if they find anything. どこかで奴が闘技場で戦う姿を見てほしい。See how strong he is. あれば教えてくれ。闘技場に生まれる。The strongest warrior in the empire gets beaten to a pulp. この俺では知略で奴には勝てない。頼みとなるのは人の心だけだろう。I didn't expect this to be so early. I thought it maybe would be like halfway through the season. Is this? Oh no, it is. Next episode, no! Okay, <laughs> this was episode 3 of Overlord season 4. And man, it's. This was, again, an episode that was a bit slower, again, right? But very, very, very packed with information. Like all the slain theocracy stuff they talked about, um, with the black scriptures, the sunlight scriptures, um, the. Astrologist or whatever it was. I don't know if it was. I don't know. What did they call it? Let me. Can I check this really quick? Uh, Thousand Leagues Astrologer. Yeah. Um, That's something new. Um, And then, <clears throat> ev like, everything else that, again, the Empire plans to, like, go behind Ein's back and try to find ways to team up with some other people to find a way to de to defeat him, to kill him. Um, but it's not working out. <laughs> and those people in the slain theocracy are basically just like, yeah, if, if that's true, what the astrologer saw, the 500 death knights and 120 or 130,000 dead in like one spell, yeah, that's like messed up. <laughs> we don't know what to do. And uh, it's so good. And now Ian's coming in again and it's like, hey! How you doing, bro? I hope you're good. <laughs> it was so good. Um, so yeah, I guess next episode we see the fight against uh, the Warrior King, which is like this big, ultra strong troll in full armor uh, from the Empire that is supposedly the strongest force in the Empire, and we know he will get fucked up <laughs> from Ainz. <laughs> he stands no chance whatsoever. By the way. It's a troll, right? Trolls can regenerate. Right? We, I mean, we fought a big troll um, in Season 2 <clears throat> with the snake guy. And when Ainz, like, destroyed his leg, it, like, regrew. Or when he sliced his chest or whatever. Um, so trolls can regenerate, right? So they are like, oh, he heals. And then Ainz completely destroys him or something, I guess. This will be awesome. Everyone will be shocked and everyone will shit his pants. <laughs> oh, it will be so awesome. Um, but yeah, also, like, at the beginning of the episode, of course, how could I forget? Um, Alberto, he gave her a kiss on the cheek. Oh, that's so good. It's so sweet. Uh, and a hug. And a hug, of course. Oh, it's so good. I hope we see more of that. I mean, I feel like in this season, Ainz is, like, more open towards Alberto. I mean, in episode one, he gave her compliments like he likes her cute smile uh he he thinks she smells good and now he gave her a kiss on the cheek and he hugged her and alberto is just melting for excitement and happiness um and yeah okay, okay now we know what the staff is also that it's a world item that can pro protect her basically um so yeah lots of good stuff in this episode um Anything else? I mean, lots of information from the Slank Theocracy, then the beginning with Albedo, then the end with the arena and all that stuff, where Ainz comes in and destroys um, 
El Nick's plans of forming alliances with the uh, slain theocracy. I mean, we so far we've never seen much of the slain theocracy, right? This is like pretty much the first time that we saw something from them, besides like some small little scenes um, here and there. Um, so this is like the most we have seen of them, basically, I would say. Uh, where they actually actually talk but i'm like really interested in the girl from the black scriptures that we see that we have seen in season two at the beginning with the Rub a rubik's cube with the white and black hair no i was it white and black hair or, or was it a white and a black eye it might have been a white and a black eye and black hair but yeah i'm interested in her i want to see her because she's has this whole deal going on from like are they strong no they are not She's not that strong. No, no, it was like, she was like, yeah, who's stronger, me or her? Like, Shaltia. And he, the dude was like, yeah, you are stronger. And she's like, oh, yeah, that's a bummer because she wants someone to find someone that is, like, stronger than her because she wants to find out how strong a kid could be. She could bear with, like, someone that is stronger than her. And she doesn't care if it's, like, someone ugly or if he is twisted or whatever. So, I mean, if she would find Eins, she would get destroyed. And then she would fall in love with him. So I want to see the reaction because it could go either way. It could either be like, she could either fall in love with him and be like, man, that's exactly what I want. He's so strong. I want a kid with him. Or it could become this weird thing where someone is like, yeah, I want this to happen. And then when it actually happens, it, the person gets pissed and is like, no, nah, no, this can't be happening. No one can be stronger than me. I want to see what happens, right? So, but yeah, from what I've heard, apparently we won't see that for a long time her taking action in the anime or whatever because i think it's later i don't know i just can't wait to see if it happens or not i hope it happens uh, but we will see but yeah that's it for this episode if you like what you saw and if you want to support me leave a like subscribe or a comment i would really appreciate it it would it would really help me and i would say till next time bye bye